too. So like when you're working through a drill design and for a client or you're looking at someone's drill, what are, what are the, the things that you most commonly fix or what are the things you could flip the question? What are the things that you typically see that are what you would consider a mistake and what we're talking about? Step size, step size, step size, step size. You know, I, I, I talked in, in several clinics I've done, I talk about sort of the non-negotiables. Um, and one is um, forward step size, never larger than a six to five, backward step size, never larger than a seven to five. Now, as I said uh, earlier, uh, on the music side of things, that applies to 95%. Obviously, there's gonna be reasons or there's gonna be your occasional kid on the end of forms or pinwheels or something like that. But 95% of the time, limit yourself to those step sizes. Um, I look at intervals uh, as well and the ability to, uh, can I adjust intervals to make the step sizes more uh, comfortable? And uh, I also have to look at staging, you know, just for, you know, if the, uh, if there's a woodwind feature moment, they shouldn't be behind the front hash uh, on the, the 25 yard line while the high brass is playing also you know, eight steps off the front sideline, even though the high brass is marked, you know, piano, it still makes absolutely no sense for that to, to be the case. So I'll look at some staging. Um, and then I basically just kind of go through everything one page at a time. 